going on? <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Juliet. Today I'm going to talk about the treatment of blood cancers. Treatment for blood cancers depends on the type of cancer, how old you are, how fast the cancer cells are multiplied, what other tissues the cancer has spread to one other factor. Treatment for blood cancers include chemotherapy, other radiation therapy, and bone marrow transplants. Remember in the last video I said that blood cells are formed in the bone marrow, so most blood cancers start in the bone marrow. Many times, a bone marrow transplant is the only possible cure. But a bone marrow transplant is the only okay if the patient can find a donor that matches the patient's tissue type. This tissue is a marker called the human nucleoside antigen or HLA marker. You can call it HLA marker. Like the barcodes on toys at a toy store. And like how the barcode will tell the store if like the toy, which I have a lot, <laughs> can tell the store if the if the toy belongs to that store or not. Because <laughs> Toys don't belong here, they belong at the toy store, just like this one. I'm not going to show you now, I'll show you later. The patient's immune system uses these markers to recognize which cells belong to your body. This depends on the patient's ethnic background. Because uh, the patient will likely match a donor with the same ethnic background. My dad says if a patient finds a match, the match donor will probably look like the patient and make similar foods as the patient. The closer the match is between the patient's marker and the donor's marker, the more likely the patient's body will accept the new bone marrow. If the patient's body accepts the donor's bone marrow, then the new bone marrow will replace the patient's cancer cells with healthy cells. Please join me in my next video about how you can help people with blood cancer. Thanks for watching. Oh, first game here.